Let's make a bookcase. Use the rectangle tool to make a rectangle that is 4 feet 18 inches. Notice that I had to put a foot symbol after 4 because the default is in inches, so you don't need to type that symbol. Push pull it up 6 feet. Always type in the number you want right after doing an operation. Offset to make some edges. Again, you can type a number or just offset by eyeballing. Push pull in. And now we have the body of the shelf of the bookcase. Triple click to select it all and then make it a group so the shelves won't stick to it. Now use the rectangle tool to make a shelf. And this can be a little tricky sometimes, but keep trying. And once you've done it, double click to select its face and perimeters, and then make it a component. We're going to array this component. To do that, first copy it with move and the control key and then the array will be in between those two shelves. Type slash 3, as you can see in the measurements box, and then you will get two shelves with three spaces in between them. Now we don't need the first shelf anymore and the original copy, so erase them. and then edit the remaining component shelves. Double click to open the component editing box and give them some height and thickness. That is push back their thickness. Now if you want a top, then offset the top face Oops, can't do that because remember it's a group, so open the group editing box and now offset the top face. It can be a bit tricky too. And then push pull it up. And there you have it.